Schwinnart, penalty to Sai Danwa, and your commentators are Bill Laurie and Mark Taylor. It's a good start. Ball coming onto the bat, he punches it through cover. And pick up three of the outfielders very fast, and good afternoon, Mike Taylor. Good afternoon, Bill, and good afternoon to everyone at home. Beautiful afternoon in Perth as Gurkha takes up the attack from the river end, the Wacker ground. This one swinging away, and there'll be four wides. Late swing there, swung the wrong way. DJ had no hope. It's poorly bowled. He got the line wrong here. Unfortunately for Digay, the keeper, the ball kept swinging after it bounced. It went past the edge and it kept swinging away. Down the leg side, Digay couldn't get there. Trying to dab it to third man, dragging it onto the stumps. Sweeten up his 
broken through for India. Pakistan have lost their first wicket to 77. Ijaz Ahmed, the new batsman, and uh, well, he's 31 years of age. He's got uh, a strike rate of 80. And, uh, he's played that one very nicely. Got off the mark well there and uh, into the fence for four. So, uh, well, that's well played. Saw the man just a little wide down at fine leg, played it a little fine. Right off the middle of the bat, lovely leg glide. Right. 
Singh. He's, uh, I'm afraid that uh, Sachin Tendulkar is being forced to try every single thing he can because it's not going too well for him at the moment. 5.67 runs and over. Oh, he's hit that in the air. This could be out, actually. But on running around, should catch that. Oh, that's bad, bad fielding. Well, sachin has got his hands on his hips, and why wouldn't he? Joshi's uh, out of the ground down there, and, uh, well, he looked like a carter's the way he was going across the ground. That one's in the air as well, and will it get caught? Ganguly will catch it. Of course he will. Of course he will. Ganguly down there. This team is called Tenduka Ganguly. Yes, and once again, it's Inzimar who gets caught. He seems to be the only Pakistani player that picks out the fields, but he can catch. It's a short ball for Robert Singh, and Inzimar was just trying, I think, to roll it down to fine leak for a single or two. Ended up getting a top edge. It was just a little flick. But unfortunately for Inzimar, picked out Ganguly. He judged it nicely. She dropped him a little bit towards the end. He did well. Ted Duke was relieved. Finally, one goes to hand. Inzimar departs for 35. Pakistan 4 for 165. Mohan Khan, the new batsman. Strike rate of 80.5, so um, won't be slowing things down. Another no ball called. Well, there's, uh, there's a bit of a bonus. Four runs. That's a no ball. It was clipped behind square leg and what should have been two, plus an overthrow, meant it was three runs and plus the no ball. Always uh, that one nips back a little. That is a good delivery. And uh, it takes the score on to 180. Actually, a good delivery, just nipped back a little bit.
that uh, Razak isn't playing tonight. It's going to be Prasad from the river end. It's cracked out to the backward point. That's very well hit. He's not the prettiest looking player, uh, as a Mahmood, but he can be effective, as the South Africans found out. A lot of his test centuries have come against South Africa. Tree. We're going to join it with the first ball. 
It's uh, Waji Makram bowling to Sachin Tendulkar and your commentators Tony Gregg and Mark Taylor. Boys uh, smashed that first one for four. Sachin Tendulkar I think has decided that uh, winning well is going to be the way they're going to do it. It's going to either happen quite quickly so it improves their net run rate or uh, it'll be over quickly. What a shot to start this. Yes, if one ball's any indication, it seems to be the thinking in that man's mind there. Wakar Yunus, who's missed the last few games, full Pakistan will open the bowling. He's in to replace Abdul Razak. Just a nice little breeze there. Wakar Yunus will try and swing the ball in towards the left-handed Ganguly. That's out, caught behind. Yes, well taken. He's got a wicket with his first ball. Wakar Yunus. Well, that uh, is a big wicket for Pakistan. What a good first delivery it was, too. It was uh, just swinging in a little bit. It was absolutely down the right path, and it was a big deflection. Yes, it was the ball actually swung in. Just maybe just held its line a little off the seam. That's a great start for Wakar Yunus and for Pakistan. Gangul is out for one. India one for seven. Rahul Dravid. Well, he's uh, due to make a very important uh, contribution in one of these matches. Now's the time to do it. Right, let's have a look at the dismissal again. So Wakar Yunus, who played in Australia a few times, will know you've got to kick the ball up here at the Wacker. So he did first ball. Nice fullish length delivery. A little bit of swing in towards the left-hander. Just held its line. There's no feet movement there from Ganguly. Good thick edge. And Mohan Khan takes the, does the rest. Waka is right on the money here. Keeping the ball up. He's using this little bit of breeze. Swinging it away. And an excellent line and length. Put the pressure right on the Indian batsman. shot lovely straight drive he plays that shot superbly gets across just a little bit further than he needs to and then hits it back fast the stumps on the opposite side on the onside of the stumps oh that's a lovely cover drive it's just an excellent piece of cricket there's nothing wrong with the delivery really it's uppish swing away tendulka forward full face of the bat beautiful straight drive Wakai Yunus continuing and swinging it as well and uh, that one beats cover. I think they'll probably reach the boundary as well. This is a very fast outfield and if you can get it to the fieldsman, chances are it'll go for four. Well, the Indians here, while Tendulkar is out there, will have some hope. This is the small margin of error we're talking about. This delivery from Wakai is only just fractionally short of a length. Just gives Tendulkar enough time to rock onto the back foot. Once again, that full face of the bat, beautifully timed. See, it's only probably half a metre short of a length. To a player of Tendulkar's calibre, that's four runs. Exactly the same shot, and that will beat the field as well, and that will be four as well. Sachin Tendulkar. I think quite fancies this surface. He knows the outfield's fast, and he also knows, unfortunately, that it's up to him. Once again, this is just a magnificent batting. There's nothing wrong with the delivery. It's up there. It's not a bad line length. It's not a half volley. It's just a beautiful cover drive. Youngster watching. That's how to play the cover drive. Watch as the foot goes forward and across. The elbow's up. Beautifully timed. Beautifully placed. Oh, that's well bowled, and he's given him. He's given him out. I don't think. Uh, I don't think he hit that one. Tenduka reacting there uh, just a little bit. Well, oh, that's uh, very unfortunate. I don't believe he's given him out. LBW. That uh, couldn't have been the case. Uh, well, yes, he's uh, he's very frustrated. You don't often see him react like this. He's now pausing to have a look at the screen. I don't know that he'll get uh, any joy out of that. Because 
something to his knee. It's not really an external blow, it's more of a strain. And the BBS Laxman will now bat at number four. And Jacob Martin will make a brief appearance at the crease. So let's have another look at the wicket in any event. Here we go. Yes, I think Sachin Tendulkar is a little unlucky here. The ball comes back off the seam. It's the top of the front pad. So there's obviously a noise here. I think the noise is that front pad, that front left pad. This is Matt Graham continuing. Oh, that's out. Caught behind. Yes, beautifully bowled. He swings one back in. Beautiful ball. Then the next one goes relatively straight and finds the outside edge. That is absolutely magnificent. Yes, that's an outstanding piece of new ball bowling. Swung the one back in the previous delivery. This one just holds its length and line. Good edge through to Moen Khan. It's just a classic opening bowler's wicket. Rahul Dravid didn't do a lot wrong, but he departs for three. India in all sorts of trouble at three for 23. He's a new batsman, and he's out there as a result of some wonderful bowling. Was he Makram? bowled two deliveries there and just look at this one first of all how it swings it swings back in over the top of the stumps and look at the keeper taking it going down the leg side and having bowled that one he then comes up with the next one starts in the same place and goes straight through and uh, he does that all at high pace and uh, that really is brilliant bowl. India three for 24 
the fielder is. If he's a quick moving fielder, Shoaib Malik is very, very swift. He's got his man. Jacob Martin, run out. Shoaib Malik played slowly on the offside. He was very quickly in there. Some of Digay, the runner. Jacob Martin was fractionally slow away. Got him easily, got him by the best part of half a metre. Jacob Martin has run out by Shah Malik. India now six for 190. Jit Agurka, new batsman, he's had a torrid time this summer with the bat, bowled well at times. But he hasn't made too many runs so far this summer.
crowd, so he immediately grabbed the stump. Waka taking aim and bang. Chobe was right on hand to whip the stump out of the ground. Agatash Prasad run out for 14. Shabagal Shwinat remained 8 not out. India all out for 157. Their required target was 262. So it has been a comprehensive win for Pakistan. Very good performance from them and uh, one that will stand them in good stead when they